baby sis. Big signs for a day. Do you need any help? I don't need your help. I can do it on my own. Just trying to be nice. But remember, we Martins don't give up. It's not easy, you know. Being a Martin, when all your teachers talk about is what a great student Rombi was, and how many science fairs you won. I guess I just thought this time I'd get a trophy for once. Like you. CJ, do not be like me. Have you seen my life? Do you have any idea how many hours I spent in middle school locked in my room alone working on science projects? I'm the one who should be jealous. Of me? You and the guys, you're out there. You're trying new things on your list. Crazy things. Things I wish I did in middle school. It is a pretty cool list. There's your science fair project. Can a list of wild things to do make middle school better and get you ready for high school? I hypothesize. Yes. 100 Things to Do Before High School is an ongoing experiment about breaking out of your comfort zone, trying new things, and making the most of our middle school years. And while the experiment isn't over yet, the results so far have been wildly positive and rewarding. And in conclusion, with friends by your side, a spirit ready to rise, and an ever-expanding list of middle school adventures, there's nothing you can't do. Because when you think about it, our lives are the greatest experiments we'll ever do. Well done, Miss Martin. I'm ready to be judged. Midnight! Meet Robot 5000! destroyed the entire science fair. Except Crispo, whose project survived the robot war. Okay. Since every other project is destroyed, here. totally enter the science fair. You might win shiny trophies or make some interesting connections. Dude, we've never seen anyone achieve that level of potato velocity. Impressive work. <coughs> and no matter what, you're sure to make some amazing discoveries, like I did when I got home. Greatest CJ Martin ever. Outstanding achievement in sisterhood. Number one list maker. My favorite person award.